Hello everyone, it's Tsukiko here. Uh, first thing you're going to want to do is to get the AA OCD polling system work to work, you're going to want to make the AA workbench. Uh, you can do that right from your crafting, and it's right here. And once you get that crafted in place, you're going to access the inventory. You're going to want to start off with the OCD storage vaults right here. Um, if you want something that'll hold an, a good amount and it's cheap to make, you're going to want to make this one. Um, the most, this one's the most expensive, but it holds most items. These are the ones that I use. Uh, what you're also going to want to make is one of the control console, the AA vacuum. Uh, you can also make the AA industrial grinder and the AA refrigerator and freezer. Um, I will also I will go over those as well towards the end of the video. Um, once you get those made, we're going to go up to the vaults. The first thing you want to do is get all your vaults set up. So you're going to lay down your vaults and you're going to name them. Um, and make sure when you name them, you put in one of each item that you want in there. So for example, I'm going to go down, since I emptied my thatch and wood and stone and flint, uh, stone and flint already, I'm going to go grab in one of each item. I'm going to go back up, and I'm going to put in my thatch and wood, and then I'm going to hit show OCD menu, select all, and confirm. Then close that. And exit out of there. And same thing with the flint and stone. Select all, confirm, close menu. Another thing is, is when you set these up, if you want to rename your OCD vault, when you set them down, they're always going to say this. So you're going to hit rename, put in the name that you want, then press accept. Then you're going to go into the wheel again and use custom name. And there you go. Uh, now we're going to go down to the control console. And everything is still in there because it's not an automatic thing. Sometimes it takes a little bit for everything to pull. So if you're impatient, like me, you can hit manually sort. And it'll automatically pull everything and it added a gotcha crystal. That will, I'll take care of later, so just never mind that. So now that you got all of that set up, um, there will be an issue with uh, things pulling from structures that you don't want it pulled out of. So you're going to hit exclude structures right here, and you're going to check mark everything that you don't want pulled out of. So, like, I don't want um, things taking out of my smithicator. If I'm trying to make stuff, I don't want things taken out of it, right? So I have a check marked. Then you'll hit confirm, close menu, close menu. So when you have that all set up, you're gonna enable auto sorting. Mine's already enabled because I already have everything set up. Another neat little thing is the vacuum. The vacuum makes it so you can drop anything that you don't want to take to the vault. Uh, let's see. Uh, so we're going to go down back to a vault. I'm just going to grab something, anything. So let's see. We'll grab this. Here's it. And we're just going to drop it. 
this is convenient so if you teleport to your base or you, if you have that mod um it'll automatically pick everything that you drop and for a quick drop and leave situation so what i'll do is it'll vacuum will pick it up eventually the control console will pick it up and the control console will move it to a metal vault it's not automatic i believe i already said this already it takes time um so that's all that it is for the vaults now for the grinder what happens is if you have something that's useless like say a primitive bow you don't want a primitive bow you just drag the primitive bow to your inventory put it in the grinder inventory hit add resource to list and see it already says that I have stuff added to the list and then you can hit grind all and it will grind all of everything that was pulled from the control console and the control console will pull the grinded ingredients and put it in the proper vaults now for your refrigerator oh, that's the freezer I don't ever use the freezer I just think it looks nice the refrigerator alright so you just take your refrigerator item put it in the refrigerator add resource to list and it'll automatically pull all refrigerator items and put it in the refrigerator for you all thanks to the control console um and I believe that is it if there's any questions you can feel free to contact me or if you're part of my server you can also ask in general um I am an admin of the server Arxalation so if you're interested I will leave a um, description down below if you want to check it out alright you'll have a great day and happy arcing